everyone, what's up? Today is day nine of the 21 day challenge by Pet Wellbeing. Widge and I are very excited for today's challenge because it's teaching your dog a new trick and your dog is never too old to learn a new trick. I'm not too sure what I want to train Widget today. One thing that like we've been working on for the last couple of days is learn to put his toys away in the basket. So I think I'm gonna just keep working on that and we'll see how it goes. He does understand like how to like pick up things and bring them to me, but he's still understanding the concept of me asking him to put it back into the bin. If you're not too sure what to train your dog, don't worry, go online. There are tons of resources on different tricks that you can train your dog. You can start with something as easy as give a paw, or you can teach them to retrieve things for you, or maybe open a fridge and fetch you a beer. Let's get started. This challenge is very enriching and it's great for your dog. It gets them thinking, which is perfect, especially for me where it's a rainy day outside and we kind of need to do some activities indoors. So what better way than to do a quick little training session? Don't forget to join us on these challenges. Click the link in the description. We are already on day nine. There are eight other challenges before this that you can do with your dog. You're gonna have a lot of fun. So come on, let's go and do some training. I'm just gonna grab a little bit of treats for Widget, but I'm not gonna use like treat treats. I'm going to use some of his kibble. He's on a little bit of a diet, so I don't wanna give him too many treats today, but he'll do anything for kibble, so it works out. If your dog isn't super food motivated and needs a little bit of motivation to learn some new tricks, feel free to use a high value treat. All right, so I'm just gonna grab some kibble. As you can see, I have a lot of pet well-being products here. Um, so let me just grab some kibble. Are you ready to do some training? Yeah, you're gonna love today's challenge. Look at this little tail wagging, look at the fluff. I have this giant basket of toys that I'm just going to kind of sprinkle around and then we will work on widget retrieving all of it. I'm probably just gonna sit here just cause then I'm in the camera a little bit easier. I got my treats here, I got the toys all over the floor and I got the basket kind of in between my legs just so that it'll be easier for him to drop it if I have to remind him to drop it. So let's see how it goes. Pick it up. Good boy, in the bin. Yes, good job. And then just making sure to reward them. Can you pick it up? Yes, in the bin. Drop. Yes. Pick it up. In the bin. Yes, good job. I started this like yesterday or the day before, so he seems to be understanding it really quick. <laughs> You're so smart. Yes, good boy. In the bin. He's trying so hard to just like give it to me. He's getting frustrated that I'm not just immediately using it. Oh. Yes, put it in the bin. Oh. Mild distraction stepping on a squeaky toy. He has too many toys, it's literally overflowing. Make sure to reward consistently when they're doing what you're asking. That was so much fun. Honestly, it's great to try and teach your dog to put toys back in their basket because he's constantly taking out his toys. So it's nice to just be able to tell him, put your toys back in the bin. What new trick are you gonna teach your dog? Leave a comment below. I want to hear about what you're teaching your dog and maybe I'll see if Widget knows that trick and if not, I'll try and teach it. Don't forget to like and subscribe and join on these challenges with us. You're not gonna wanna miss day 10. Bye guys.